The right wing tends to be more honest about what they actually believe, what they really, really believe. Unless, of course, they're a demographic that doesn't have much power. You know, like minorities and women, right? And then they're supposed to essentially emulate the words of Tammy Wynette's hit. Stand by You're supposed to suck it up and argue for the status quo. And it stems from the belief that if things are good for the majority, they'll be good for everyone else. The left generally talks in terms of what they strive to believe, usually accompanied by virtue signals, regardless of if they actually believe that way in reality. Unless, of course, it's a demographic that doesn't have much power, again, like women and minorities. And in that case, you can be as bigoted as you want. For instance, I could make a video complaining about straight people and I'd get congratulated by many on the left, or some on the left, the far left. Generally, the only people who would congratulate some straight white guy complaining about minorities would be people on the right, the far right. I think we need to have a healthy mix of being honest about what we actually believe and what we strive to believe. I think it's a good thing for us to strive to be better as humans. We shouldn't pick on different groups and tell those groups to be better. We should instead be telling everyone to be better. If we tell just certain groups to be better, it will backfire in many ways, at least for some, and it will bring out the worst in those groups. That's not something to strive for, that's for sure. It's usually counterproductive and usually involves identity politics of some sort. The straight white guys on the left, who virtue signal the loudest, are usually the ones who are the most bigoted in their actual beliefs. If you were to give some of these people sodium pentothal or get them really drunk, and you ask them how they really feel, you'd probably find some really bigoted things. Because, likely for many, many years, they've refused to look at those things in themselves in order to tame them or even understand them. Because, well, they've been drowning themselves in virtue signals for all those years. Now, provided they're not doing it to be mean, and there are indeed a lot of people out there who are just mean-spirited and they just want to hurt people because it somehow makes them feel better, you know, so provided they're not doing it to be mean, the people on the right, or many of the people on the right, who are the most blatant about how they actually believe, are actually the most caring for their fellow human beings when you look at their actual actions and how they treat their friends. You know, those harsh friends who tell it like it is, but they take a bullet for you.